Hi guys, so a few of you have been asking to see a quick tour um, of my new studio space. Um, I'll give you a quick rundown of the room, um, show you around and I'll show you some of the gear, some of the guitars I have in here. We use this space a lot for recording guitars, um, I do a lot of session work, but I also do a lot of film scoring, a lot of production in here. Um, so I'll show you some of the guitars that I have. This is the first guitar, I've got a Warmoth Strat with a roasted maple neck. Um, probably my main guitar that you see in most of my videos. This is my other guitar, um, another custom Telecaster from Warmoth. Um, same exact neck as the Strat, uh, roasted maple, Sir pickups, gold hardware. Um, yeah, beautiful guitar. This is the oldest guitar that I have. It's a Gibson SG Standard. I got this in 2014. It was my first really good guitar. Um, it's been all over the world. It's pretty beaten up, has a lot of scratches, a lot of dings. Um, but it's a great sounding guitar. This is my most recent purchase. It is a D'Angelico Deluxe SS um, and it's a, a limited edition ba uh, baby blue color. I think that's what it's called. Um, yeah, I really like this guitar. A lot of my friends have this. Um, I see a lot of people online so I, I tried it in Nam one year and I had, to, I had to get one. It's a beautiful sounding and looking guitar. So this is my acoustic guitar, it's a Mitchell acoustic guitar. I actually got it really cheaply from Guitar Center for about $120. Um, I had a gig that night and really needed an acoustic guitar. So I posted a video playing this and then the company actually sent me two more guitars. Um, so they sent me this one, this one, and this one. They're really great quality for the money, they're really cheap. And the Strat that they sent me sounds absolutely phenomenal. Okay, so here is my studio setup. So I have my little M Audio keyboard here, my MacBook Pro and my monitor, a little Furman power conditioner that everything is plugged into at the back. I actually have two sets of speakers because I have two rigs here. So for recording all of my guitar and my production stuff, I use this MacBook Pro. And for recording all my film scoring work, I do a lot on this this old Mac Pro tower. Um, it's really, it's a really beast of a machine. Um, so I have these small M audio speakers that are connected to the Mac Pro tower. And then I have these Adam A7X monitors, which are amazing monitors. Um, and they are connected to my main MacBook Pro through this Apollo Twin, which is an amazing device. Um, the plugins that come with this are incredible. Um, then I have this AKG C214 microphone. Um, it sounds amazing, great for vocals, great for acoustic guitar. Uh, I've got my Gibson stool over here. I have my three main guitars right here on the wall. Um, and then we've got some more acoustic panels on this wall, my D'Angelico and the Mitchells that I was talking about down here. Couch for whenever I have songwriting sessions or people are over recording. And then I've got my tripod. Here's my somewhat messy pedal board. And I just have a small little Bugera amp. Um, it's kind of perfect because we're in an apartment right now, so um, I don't really use this too much. I use it for small gigs. Um, and then up here I have a little signed score from a composer, Patrick Doyle, who I worked with back in Scotland when we worked on a film together. Um, and these acoustic panels are actually really, really good. They're from a company called Next Generation Acoustics. And I got six of them for pretty for a pretty cheap price, um, and they're all custom made, and you can ch change the dimensions. Um, so that is pretty much my studio. I'll give you a wide angle here, and that's it. That's where I film all my videos, do all my work.